Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, I hope everyone had a great day, had a great weekend. Today, I'm going to talk to you about five maintenance tasks that you need to do before you sell your home or if you're interested in selling your home. Um, and a lot of these tasks are geared mostly towards the single family home. Um, but if you have a condo or a townhome, you can also utilize these tasks as well. All right, so the first one I'm going to talk about is, and these are in no particular order, by the way, but the first one is going to be clean out your gutters and clean off your roof. Okay, if you have a single family home or if uh, you have a town home, when people pull up to view your home, they're going to see your roof. That's probably going to be the first thing. And if your roof is not clean, it's, your home is not going to look presentable. Okay, um, get someone, hire someone to clean out the gutters. If your gutters, gutters are clogged up and you've had a little bit of rain or, um, you know, the day before or the week before, it's going to cause puddles to uh, be created around your home. And that's also going to take away from your home being presentable. OK, so make sure that you get out your uh, clean out your gutters and make sure that you clean off your roof. OK, the next thing I want to talk about, number two, would be to get the HVAC service. OK, you should be getting your HVAC service. Um, if not every year, at least every other year, uh, this will take off of the bill, the monthly bill, whether it be your AC unit in the summertime or your heater in the uh, winter. OK, this cuts down on your bill and it also makes it feel uh, a little bit more towards the temperature that's desired. So if it's in the winter time and you're running the heater, your house is going to warm up a lot easier and a lot quicker. And then vice versa, in the summertime, you're running the AC your house is going to seem much cooler. Okay, that's very important too because when people are viewing your home, they're going to want to feel comfortable while they're in the home. So you really want to make them comfortable. Um, my previous experience, I've had buyers come to me and you know some of their decisions have been based off of what the monthly bills are. So if you can show them that you have a low monthly bill because you are constantly getting your HVAC service, um, you know that's something that they don't have to worry about. And then they also don't have to worry about the life of it too because they know that it was very well kept so they don't have anything um, of any concern as they go into making an offer on your home. Okay. The next thing is keep all the unwanted guests out. And what I mean by unwanted guests, I mean um, those little animals that tend to try to make a home mostly in the attic area um, of the home, of the house rather. They tend to come in when it's cold out. They want to get a place that's warm they want to nest and god knows whatever else they're doing up there okay so be mindful of that that could have easily happened and you not have known it it could have been several months that you've gone up to your attic and they just have created a nice little nest up there okay so that's something that you definitely want to take a look at uh, get someone to check it out if you don't want to check it out yourself but make sure that all of that is taken care of and make sure that um, those areas have been cleaned out Okay. The next thing I want you to do is uh, curb appeal. Okay. Make sure that you keep up the yard um, near your home or in your home rather. Uh, you want to make sure that the grass is mowed, that it looks you know, clean. Um, if you like planting um, flowers, you can get some flowers planted around. You just want to make sure that it looks presentable. Curb appeal is you know, everything. It can make it or break a deal. Okay, so that that's something that you definitely want to um, remember because it does make your house look presentable. I mentioned that when I was talking about the roof. When people are pulling up, they see your roof, they see the home, and then they notice the lawn. If the lawn is not, um, if the lawn does not look like it's up to par, then that's gonna start off the showing with a negative sense, and that's something that you don't really want to do. Okay, the last thing that I want you to do is to check your windows make sure that your windows are clean okay i have gone into a couple of showings where i've had buyers and we're walking through the house and they might have a great view whether it be in a condo and you can see a skyline or a lake or you know in this case a single family home and you might just want to look out over the neighborhood over the yard and because those windows are not clean 
um, it takes away from the view. So it takes away from the experience. So that's something that you want to do. It makes the house look more clean itself, especially from the outside. And again, it's all about presentation. That's one of the most important things that you can think about when you're listing or trying to sell your home. You got to have a great presentation. Presentation is going to get buyers to come in and it's going to get people to submit offers. All right. So those are some five things that I wanted to share with you, uh, some maintenance tasks that I want you to do before you decide to list your home or if you're trying to sell your home. OK, you want to keep up the yard. You want to uh, produce nice curb appeal. You want to get the HVAC service, get the heater, get the uh, AC unit, get them serviced. OK, call a company, have them come out and do it. You want to clean out your gutters and clean off the roof. Okay, you can call another company. They can help you out with that. Make sure the outside is looking presentable. You want to check up in the attic or any other maybe hot spots that you might have where you might think an animal could have come and lay rest or might be hanging out or, you know, just uh, making themselves a little nest down there. Okay, you want to watch out for those areas and then you want to get your windows clean. All right. So these are the five things that I wanted to share with you. Uh, don't forget, if you want to contact me, you can reach me on my social media contact in the description box below. Uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, make sure that you like this video and then also make sure that you leave a comment on the video as well. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. Let me know um, if there is a question that you have about real estate and then I can create a video to answer your question. Um, and try to help you out the best way that I can. Thanks so much, and I look forward to seeing you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.